اعوذ باللہ من الشیطان الرجیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم آئی ایم ڈاکٹر عبد الباری خان آئی ہیو ہیڈ دا پریولیج ٹو بی دا فاؤنڈنگ سی ای او آف دا دین انڈس ہاسپٹل اینڈ ناؤ آئی ایم آنر ٹو بی دا فاؤنڈنگ پریزیڈنٹ آف انڈس ہاسپٹل اینڈ ہیلتھ نیٹ ورک آئی فائنڈ مائی سیلف ویری فارچونیٹ ٹو بی ایبل ٹو ہینڈ اوور مائی آپریشنل رسپانسبلٹیز ٹو ڈاکٹر ظفر زیدی ہو از ناؤ دا سی ای او of the network. Both professionally and personally, I can only be grateful and thankful to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for giving me such a rewarding and blessed life. I was fortunate to be born in a religious family where amongst many values, two fundamentals shape my professional and personal life. My father always prayed for me to become a doctor with humility and conviction to serve the humanity with respect and dignity. Secondly, my family taught me to have unshakable faith in Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Yani, غیر متزلزل یقین اور یہاں سے. These two fundamentals proved to be my driving forces, especially when the dream of Indus Hospital seemed to be insurmountable. Fifteen years on, the Indus Hospital and Health Network is across Pakistan and aspiring to go global. More importantly, and contrary to general opinion that we will not be able to sustain free of cost services and model alhamdulillah we continue to be absolutely free of cost and will remain so having said that 15 years on our services and our model need significant thinking planning and consolidation for the future as a result of it we have developed six distinct areas of intervention, services, outreach, and expansion. As president, it is my main responsibility to ensure that all of us work towards achieving the goals set in these six areas. Number one, we must invest in creating a nationwide integrated primary health network accessible to all. Indus Hospital was founded by me and my three friends who are clinicians working in a tertiary care hospital. At the outset, we realized that the solution of healthcare problems in Pakistan lies in an integrated primary health network only. That is precisely why building a primary health network is our first strategic direction, be it physical, mobile, or use of technology like telehealth. Number two, we want to continue to build healthcare capacity at secondary and tertiary care hospitals, thereby ensuring continuum of care from primary to tertiary care. In this regard, we are building Pakistan's largest tertiary care hospital in Karachi and have just completed one in Lahore. Number three, education and capacity building for healthcare. If there has been any doubt about the critical need of the trained healthcare professionals, it has been eliminated by COVID and recent floods. For decades, I have witnessed infrastructure being built without any consideration that who will run these hospitals and equipments. That is why we are building Indus University of Health Sciences with seven colleges to bridge the gap, especially in nursing, paramedics, technologists, public health experts and pharmacists. This will be a unique institution where training will be based on values of ethics, empathy and compassion. Number four, research and development in healthcare. The challenges of healthcare in Pakistan need out of the box solution for which we have to invest in research and development. Indus aspires to be the platform for medical community of Pakistan to create evidence-based innovative solutions and be a game changer for health sector. Number five, multi-sectoral approach. And this is neatly aligned with sustainable development goals. And we strongly advocate multi-sectoral approach for a greater impact on healthcare. Therefore, Indus is always actively pursuing partnership in education, water sanitation, and poverty alleviation, and even more actively now in environment, given 
the ecological vulnerability of the world and particularly our region. Lastly, and number six, partnerships and alliances for the provision of healthcare for all. I have always maintained that the healthcare challenges of Pakistan cannot be tackled by any one sector, be it private, public, or not for profit. We all have to join hands to uplift the healthcare of this country. I am proud to be a Pakistani and I am very proud of this Pakistani nation. Time and again, I have witnessed the kindness and generosity of this nation. As far as I am concerned, the sustainability of the Indus Hospital and Health Network is already addressed. Between the unshakable faith in Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and kindness of this nation. I would like to extend my gratitude to our donors, members of board of directors, my team and my staff. I don't think I will ever have the words to thank them enough. The most rewarding part of my journey has been the prayers of the patient, the smile free of pain and suffering and the joy of going home.